All right, Flo, this guy right here is becoming a 49er local legend, you know, even though he's from L.A. <laughs> Man, we saw it from the SF Niners and post it. Um, and then I guess the wife showed up and emailed and said, hey, that's my husband. But what do you think about this, man? This guy, this Vato here, just breaking up the fight, man. You know, protecting Debo. Do you, what do you think, man? Should the 49ers hire this guy as a security guy for the Niners, man? Uh, obviously, they should give him the offer, but obviously he's not going to take it. He's from L.A. Um, <laughs> but I, I love it by this guy, obviously protecting Debo. But also just to be a Niner fan all the way out in L.A., that shows proper. I understand there's not really diehard Rams fans. Like you said last video, there's probably like 12 of them. Mm -hmm. But it's still tough being a fan in a different city. Um, we're fortunate enough to be Niner. Well, I am. Niner Giants fan. But I am a Laker fan. So I do understand how it is to go to uh, this Bay Area Stadium as a Laker fan around Warrior fans. So that's a hard thing to do. You got to have some balls. So I give this guy respect. And he is a he is a legend over here too. So I like it. What do you think, man? Yeah, man, it's, it's cool because I know Ram I was watching Romelia's sports report. He was like, "What the heck? He's a Laker fan and a Niner fan." But <laughs> dude, there's a lot of us, man. Let's be real. Um, when we were younger. The Warriors. I don't want to take a shot because I know a lot of fans are Warriors, but they weren't that good. They weren't good at all, and there wasn't much Warrior fans back in the day. So um, now they're good. So there's a lot of fans out there. But I mean, just like the there's a lot of Niner fans in LA. There's a lot of Laker fans over here too. So, but to this guy, man, that must be so cool being able to go there and actually break up a fight. Yeah. And Debo Samuel had a few words. Let's check this out right here. And uh, there was a fan in the stands who like tried to step up. <laughs> you say, what, what, what do you think of that? Real? I didn't even know. I didn't even know it until I just seen it. Uh, a fan trying to separate it, but uh, he just ran up and like kind of like headbutted me out of nowhere. And I was like, what, what's going on? But, uh, <laughs> but uh, that was kind of cool to see a fan get into it and trying to protect the team as well. <laughs> that's hilarious man that's hilarious Debo Samuel talking about that oh man I mean that's pretty cool like going to a game and actually breaking up a fight and then yeah. getting props and have your face all over <laughs> social media man but this guy is officially a 49ers legend and man that, that must be pretty cool man yeah man because like obviously he, he had really solid seats but what are the chances that's gonna happen mm -hmm. right in front of you so this guy took the most of the opportunity throw him in the Niner Hall of Fame. Let's go. Yeah, man. That, there's like a few petitions out there to get him season tickets <laughs> to Levi Stadium. Well, he's officially well, part of Levi South. Levi so, South so. so now they want to start giving him tickets to come over here to the Bay Area. But man, but that's freaking awesome. I think, uh, I don't know, man. There's so many cool storylines going on this year. It seems like this could be the year for us, man. I know I just, it looks like it's a head collision course from the 90s or the 80s with us and the Cowboys. But this right here, man, this is a hilarious story, man. All right, well, you guys let us in the comments what you guys think about Super Niner fan. Like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. See y'all next time. Peace. Peace.